Um, I'm a composer and a programmer, and I make interactive music. That's music that's improvisational, and the audience and the listener is the one who's improvising. Uh, it's realized collaboratively with the listener and a musical system, which I design. So I want these experience, I create these kind of experiences which are alive, which are different each time and personal to the people listening, uh, where the listeners have a depth of musical dimensions to explore and engage with. I'm going to describe my creative capital project in the context of my previous work. Get that? Next slide. Thank you. Um, so a lot of my work um, is about the relationship with the technologies and the platforms that I use. Uh, Jazz Computer is a collaboration with Sarah Rothberg. Uh, it uses the action of scrolling, as in Facebook and Twitter. Uh, but instead of passive information consumption, the listener is making music with it. Uh, so when the listener scrolls up, the tempo increases, the chords modulate upward, uh, the instruments get brighter, and when they scroll down, the tempo drops, gets really laid back, the song, the lyrics change. Um, and it's all created live with the user. I'll show a short video of me using this website. So Richer is an earlier piece with the same collaborator and similarly about appropriating these everyday technologies uh, and recontextualizing the habits that the technologies impose on us. Uh, so I make my money essentially typing and clicking. I work on the computer all day. And in Richer, typing and clicking generates money and puts it in the jar. <laughs> and as the jar fills up, uh, more musical layers are added to the song and the song gets richer. Uh, and like real money, when you stop clicking and typing, it disappears. <laughs> uh, so I'll play this. Song's all about work and money. <laughs> Frustration with it, automation. Um, so, in addition to composing songs in this way, uh, I also developed the underlying tools that I use to make songs in this way. Uh, this is a library called Tone.js that I've been working on for three years, uh, and it's to compose sort of high level musical ideas without needing to worry about the underlying oscillators and effects that actually generate the material. Uh, so, this is what a score for this type of piece might look like. Um, and this is an open source project that's free to use. Uh, it has a growing community of composers and coders that make music with it. Um, and I give it away for free so that this type of music can be more possible and accessible and continue to grow uh, in complexity and content and community. Um, so I also develop installation work uh, that is interactive music with the audience. Um, so like my web work, they give uh, users sort of abstract interfaces and allow them to participate in the music making process. Uh, my creative capital project will bridge the web work and the installation work that I do. I'm creating networked pieces where people connect and create with each other. Um, and uh, whereas the pieces that I showed you so far were 
singles and one-offs, my creative capital project will be an album around a cohesive theme. Uh, and where the projects that I showed were uh, sort of performing with a computer, my creative capital project is all about performing with each other and connecting through the web or through installations and creating music collectively. Um, so I'm using the process, uh, I'm using entrainment as a way to organize uh, these pieces and their participants. So entrainment is a phenomenon in which independent rhythmic processes synchronize with each other. Uh, and it occurs all over the natural world. Um, pendulums synchronize over time. Fireflies will eventually all blink in unison. We're able to tap our feet to music because of entrainment. Uh, we entrain and are entrained by each other. So I'm interested in the dynamics and the patterns, uh, the textures and the sounds that will emerge from this behavior. So the interactive album will be four to six musical pieces which allow uh, people to take an active role in the realization of the music uh, together and in a large connected way. Creating music in such a way where they feel simultaneously expressive and individual and collective, connected, and synchronized. Uh, my project is participatory and I can't do it alone. I'm looking for help on the distribution of these ideas so when these projects are finished, uh, maybe a music label type organization wants to help promote it or a gallery type space that would uh, show these pieces in a live environment. Um, secondly, for this idea to scale larger, I'm looking for well-known experimental artists who want to make music in this way um, that I'll collaborate with. I'd love to collaborate with artists like Bjork or Brian Eno on an inter interactive music experience and make something that enables many people to create and, ga and engage with music and sound in a new way. Um, I want to thank Creative Capital and all of the amazing artists that I'm humbled to be a part of. Thank you. Thank you.